Good morning, everyone. Sistiana here. Time for your daily tarot for today, December the 28th. Remember, it's a general reading for all signs, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, whatever planet you might be watching for. And if you don't know your other planets besides your sun sign, there is a video in my description. You can check out that link. It is a video where I take you through it step by step. It's a very easy process and it doesn't cost you anything. Also, if you enjoy this type of content and haven't done so already, I'd really appreciate it if you would subscribe, like, share, leave me a comment below. I love hearing from you and I do respond to those comments. So let's get this started, right? With Aries. Message for Aries while we have a flyer. We have the Seven of Swords. Some lies, manipulation, some deceit. The King of Disc dealing with a possible Earth sign towards Virgo Capricorn. Could have Earth in your chart. And the Four of Swords. Underlying energy is the devil. So you could be dealing with a Capricorn or you could have Capricorn in your chart. For someone out there, I feel like they're, someone's lying to you about their financial situation. They're not being completely honest. Or they're not, it's like, this could be your boss not being completely honest with you. That they're like, hey, take a break, take a vacation. But, and you got a job when you come back, but you really don't because the business is closing. That type of thing, okay? I just feel like somebody's lying about money and it's to do with a vacation or some type of time off. Um, it also could be to do with an illness, but I'm not really feeling like it's an illness type of thing. I feel like this is like, yeah, rest and recovery, recuperation, you know, TLC. And they're not being completely honest with you. So it's like your, your, your partner coming to you and telling you that they got some time off, that they got a vacation. But in truly, in reality, they actually got laid off, okay? I don't know. That's what I'm getting here for you, um, Aries. I hope that makes sense. I hope that message helps. And thank you for watching. Taurus. Message for Taurus for today, December 28th, please. For Taurus. We have the Hierophant, which is your card. So, dealing with a fellow Taurus is possible. Death. So, you could be dealing with a Scorpio. Or you could have Scorpio in your chart. And the Ten of Cups. Underlying energy is the Two of Swords. Ooh, okay. So, for some of you out there, you were kind of at this um, standstill. You were at this point of not really knowing what to do, not really knowing where to go, how to handle something. And you've all of a sudden had this epiphany moment. It may not have been all of a sudden. It's like, but it's out of the blue. You weren't really expecting this particular solution to be the solution type of thing, okay? I see you tackling some type of change, some type of manifestation that has a like not at all where you would normally be at in your life type of thing. And I, I see this bringing you that happiness in your home, that really rambunctious party type of energy. Um, yeah, it's like I, I see, you know, tackle that change, tackle that ending, and that's where you're going to find your happiness. Do it. Stop stalling. I get, stop stalling, Taurus, okay? It, it's going to be great. I hope the message makes sense. I hope that helps. And thank you for watching. Gemini, message for Gemini for today, December 28th, please. Three of Wands, making the decision, talking about it, talking about decisions, talking about options. The Knight of Disc, so it could be to do with finances or a move. And it's finances, Ace of Disc, Underlying Energy, Knight of Cups. Okay, 
So it hasn't been very stable for you, right? It hasn't been very stable. It's been a bit of a, you know, topsy-turny type of energy. And it's... Yeah, it's been a it's been a road, right? It's been maybe not a road, might have been a, a boat trip because it's going up and down with those motions. Um, but I see the decision working in your favor. It's bringing in new money. It's bringing in a major change. And it's bringing in more calm energy. It's bringing in more stable energy. Nice, really nice here, Gemini. So whatever this decision to do with money that you've you've recently made, just know you're on the right track, okay? I hope that makes sense. I hope that message helps. And thank you for watching. Cancer. Message for Cancer for today, December 28th, please. Cancer. The Nine of Cups, wishes, hopes, dreams, they're all in your forefront. They're all right there, right? Could be communicating about it. we got the Queen of Swords here, possibly dealing with an air sign, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. I, I feel like uh, for someone out there, like you're telling someone off, you're finally getting your moment to say something that you've truly been wanting to say, right? What's the message for Cancer, please? <clears throat> And the King of Swords, so heavy air energy there for you, that Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, underlying energy, heavy Gemini energy, we have the lovers, Cancer, Woo. okay, so relationship situation going on, and, but you're like, <clears throat> excuse me y'all, this is something you've been really hoping and dreaming and wishing for, right, but <laughs> he's like, now, you could be having communication, dealing with the law. Um, be careful. You don't want to pop off at the mouth of somebody that's, you know, that's just not cool, okay, Cancer? Just stay in your shell for a little bit longer. I feel like you just need to watch what you say, okay? But I, I don't really feel like that's for everyone. I feel like just someone out there needs to know. Just watch what you say. Don't, don't, um... Don't let the tongue fly when the brain hasn't completely processed it, okay? Um, but I do see you're getting something you've been dreaming for, you've been hoping and wishing and praying for. And it's going to lead to some communications, possibly. You finally get about to tell somebody off, somebody you're going to finally about to go, wait, bye bye, you know, that type of thing. Cancer, I hope that makes sense. I hope that message helps. And thank you for watching. Leo, message for Leo for today, December 28th, please. We have the Empress, <clears throat> and we have the Four of Swords. So, mother figure, possibly creating something new. Knight of Swords, things are going to happen very quickly. And the Three of Swords, next three days. Three weeks, three months, three days. Something big coming in, Leo. You're you're creating a opportunity for you to have rest and recuperation, to have a vacation. Underlying energy is judgment. So past events coming back, you've been dealing with the karma. You've been you like just settling out your energies, right? For someone out there, you're creating. A situation you're creating the opportunity for a vacation for rest for um, <clears throat> just smooth sailing I feel and uh, that's kind of a, a like double-edged thing because then right next to it we got that knight of swords but I feel like it's like the next three days is gonna move in very quickly for you but something in three days is going to bring in an opportunity for you to have a vacation. That sounds really nice. Really nice. I mean, 
I love that. I hope you do too. <laughs> so Leo, what are you manifesting? Let me know in the comments. I love hearing that. So I hope that message makes sense. I hope that helps. And thank you for watching. Virgo. Message for Virgo for today, December the 28th, please. <clears throat> High Priestess, trust your intuition. Six of Cups. Okay, so somebody from the past could be having thoughts of someone from the past. King of Disc, your energy, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Underlying energy is the fool dealing with a new beginning coming in. You've had this new beginning. Maybe you're looking at something or someone in a new light and you're like, you're, you're kind of hesitant. You're maybe thinking about trying to go after them or trying to uh, build that relationship. And I mean, sorry, y'all. I kind of feel like it's the right way to do it, the right move to do. <clears throat> Like, you're on the right direction, but I feel like you need to take it slow. This is not going to be a overnight success. This is going to be something that you need to really trust your intuition and take it slow. This could be a love returning to you that's going to be more stable this time, but you need to take it slow. I hope that message makes sense, Vir Virgo. I hope that helps. And thank you for watching. <clears throat> okay, Libra. Message for Libra for today, December 28th, please. The Knight of Disc. Slow and steady. Slow and steady wins the race, right? The Empress. Dealing with a mother figure. Creating something new. Take your time on it, Libra. Do not try to rush the process. The ten of... Sorry. The two of disc. Second line of income. A decision with income. Underlying energy is the hangman. So you're waiting for something to happen. You're waiting for this... You're waiting to make the decision, right? Well, don't rush it. Like, really meditate on this. Really stop and, you know, lay, write out your list. The pros and cons. What it, This is what I get if I do this. This is what I get if I do this. That What's the good and the bad with it? I just feel like you're needing to take your time with creating this whatever it is. I wanted to say situation, but it's like, so for some of you, you might be creating a situation and it's like, weigh out your pros and cons. Do I really want to do this? Do you really want to do this, Libra? I hope that makes sense. I hope that message helps. And thank you for watching. Scorpio. Message for Scorpio for today, December 28th. The Tower. Building something up. Tearing it down first, right? Tearing it down so you can build it right back up again. <coughs> and the Six of Cups. So this could be to do with a past relationship coming back in. Oh, and you're overthinking it. We've got the Nine of Swords. Underlying energy is the Chariot. So it could be to do with a Cancer. Or you could have cancer in your chart. I feel here, it's like, Scorpio, this person has just dropped into your life, right? They just dropped in, and it's kind of giving it all a ruckus. Like, this, you thought your life was great, and all of a sudden, this X pops into your head. But they're an X for a reason. Could they have changed? Yes. Could you have changed? Yes. Are you still the two compatible people? Maybe, but I, I feel like you're overthinking that. I think it's like go with your gut. Don't stress so much about whatever the the situation is, Scorpio. Yeah, I, I feel like this person's gonna really turn your life upside down. 
your heart upside down, your mind's got to be all scrambled. So, be careful. <laughs> Scorpio, be careful. Whoever's trying to come back into your life, I don't feel like it's going to be a very pleasant situation for you. Mentally, mentally, and possibly even emotionally, but mentally, it's going to give you a spin from hell type of thing, okay? I hope that message makes sense, Scorpio. I hope that helps, and thank you for watching. Sagittarius message for Sagittarius for today, December the 28th, please. Okay. So, Five of Swords and the King of Cups. Dealing with a possible water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Could have water in your chart. Victory. It's an emotional victory, though. This is a... This is like a... Okay. Ten of Wands. This is a emotional, like you're you're having this spit, this spat, this spit, this um, this little fight. Like I don't feel like it's a you know major knockdown, drag out fight. It's a battle of words. You're arguing, and this argument, careful, careful, Sagittarius. It could end a friendship or a relationship. But, because you're going to win, but then you're not going to feel so right about it afterwards. Sagittarius, please. And the Fool. Yeah, this is going to be a, a major change. Underlying Energy, Ten of Cups. Okay, so for someone out there, it was a party, right? Did you say something to the wrong person? Did you look at the wrong person the wrong way? And your person got kind of bent out of shape over it. And now you're like, but I wasn't doing anything. I just smiled at them. That's, that's what I feel like you're saying. It's like, I just smiled at them. I didn't do anything wrong. I was just being friendly. But your person didn't see it that way. Because y'all were under the influence, right? Under the influence of you know, just the atmosphere, possibly some liquid courage, but I feel like this is like, whatever it was, it was not your normal uh, atmosphere, it was not your normal surroundings, and things have gotten a bit heated up. This is going to change your dynamic, this is going to change your relationship with this person, and it's like endings and new beginnings, so, are you ending that relationship because you're realizing how untrustworthy that person is or untrustworthy you are? Like, I, I just, I get this whole major ending for that relationship. Now, for some of you, you're having this conversation and it is like, okay, well, we realize that we did wrong. You realize, you know, that person, you or that person, like, I, I'm, I'm like, I feel like I'm going back and forth with myself. Is this within yourself that you're like, okay, no, this is not the way I want to be. This is not the way I want to do things. Or are you changing yourself because you're seeing things that you're, you're not happy with? All over the place there, Sagittarius. But whatever it is, it's victory, right? It's the only positive I'm getting here. It's like this is victory, but it's an ending and a new beginning. So it's a major change for you. I hope that message makes sense for you, Sagittarius. I hope that helps. And thank you for watching. Capricorn, message for Capricorn for today, December the 28th, please. For Capricorn. The moon, possibly dealing with a Pisces or a Cancer. The moon is the ruler for Cancer. We have the seven of disc. Okay. <clears throat> and the two of disc. Underlying energy is the eight of cups. Okay. The past is on your mind. The past is on your mind, right? It, where it has been. And now you're seeing things in a new light. Now, for some of you, something's recently been revealed that you're waiting for wait a little bit longer and then you'll have a decision or you'll be able to get a decision. I don't know what that's about here. 
I, I just I feel like you're like this is gonna open up a whole new world for you and of course it's something you've been planning for a bit now because I, I, like I said the past energy is very strong past energy is very strong for you but you're still waiting and planning and grooming and and just growing you're growing from this right and then the decision what's the decision for you Capricorn I feel like it can go either way but whatever it is it's going to open up a whole new world for you I hope that makes sense Capricorn I hope that helps and thank you for watching Aquarius message for Aquarius for today December the 28th please Okay, so we have the devil. So you could be dealing with an, a, a Capricorn. We have the chariot. Could be dealing with a Cancer. Got major arcanas here. Some big events happen in Aquarius. And the ten of this. So a big, big money, right? Big win. Big victory. Underlying energy. Ace of Cups. Love overflowed. Lo, love, the, the. <laughs> Sorry, can't, Aquarius, I'm like getting tongue tied here. Like, feeling very emotional. You're tackling it. You're, now you could be feeling like you're like all over the place, like very scatterbrained, not really being able to focus type of thing. And, you got this big win, this big money coming in. I, I, I see <clears throat> pushing through. Now, there could be some manipulation or some self-indulgence, so be careful with, like, drinking in excessively, any type of recreational drugs, anything like that. Just, I, 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 I just feel like there's some in excess of something so be be careful with anything that you put into your body even if it's just sugars um just don't do do things in moderation here Aquarius be careful not to do anything in excess but I do feel like you're going to have this major victory coming in for you soon Aquarius if it's not today it's going to be soon I hope that message makes sense I hope that helps and thank you for watching. Pisces. Message for Pisces for today, December the 28th, please. For Pisces. Queen of Disc. Five of Cups. Okay, so dealing with a possible Earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Could have Earth in your chart. Two of Wands. Decisions. Got a decision to make. Underlying energy is the sun dealing with a possible Leo, or you could have Leo in your chart. It's new beginnings. And for someone, it's like someone's leaving. Someone's making a decision to leave. Someone is moving. And I, I feel like this is like to do with like one person moving out or that type of thing but I don't feel like I don't feel like it's you I don't feel like it's you I feel like it's like this other person is leaving leaving while someone's sleeping I, I don't know I get this there there's something to do with the nighttime being very important and I get very confusion, a lot of confusion here for you at least uh, as well, Pisces. Also, get like don't don't make a decision too hastily. Don't make it to without really thinking about it. Really take the time to work it out before making a decision, whoever that's about. I hope that makes sense for you, Pisces. I hope that message helps. And thank you for watching. Thank you, everyone, for joining me as usual. I hope you have a great day. Until tomorrow, bye for now.